Live from Chicago, ABC 7 Eyewitness News at 11 starts right now. Breaking at 11, confrontational protests on college campuses. The University of Wisconsin was cleared out while encampments remain at two Chicago schools. Smash and grab thieves are at it again. The Chicago clothing store targeted by a group in a Jeep. Teacher in tears, the surprise to start her morning. Her students surrounded her with love. Can't wait to see this, it's on the way. First though, college clashes over the Israel-Hamas war are growing in size and in aggression. Pro-Palestinian groups are camping out on colleges nationwide in, Miss, in Madison, Wisconsin this morning. The state patrol was called in to take down tents and to disperse crowds. The school says protesters received multiple warnings to clear out before they involved the police. 12 people were arrested. Meanwhile, in New York City, more than 300 protesters were arrested overnight. Groups broke into Columbia University building and refuse to leave. The mayor says the people causing... Live from Chicago, ABC 7 Eyewitness News at 11 continues. Turmoil on college campuses over the Israel-Hamas war. 12 people were arrested this morning in Madison, Wisconsin. Hundreds of others were taken into custody at Columbia University in New York. Officials say many of the protesters aren't college students and they are trying to cause chaos. Meantime, in Chicago, some high school students are planning a sit-in and protest to support Palestine. Christian Pico says live at Jones College Prep just off South State Street with what's going on there, Christian. Terrell and Tani, good morning. Protest organizers here at Jones College Prep tell me that sit-in is set to start at 1.45 this afternoon inside the school's lobby. Jewish students that we spoke with this morning tell me that this afternoon's demonstration has them feeling uneasy. We're just overall a lot of Jews are scared. Um, Grab criminals. This is the DTLR clothing store near 76th and South Stony Island. It appears that the driver crashed through a security gate. No word on what was taken. Tracy. This afternoon, patchy clouds out there. Highs today up into the mid 70s. Tomorrow, big range of temperatures around the area. We'll have some showers early, even some thunderstorms, maybe a few isolated ones tomorrow afternoon, yeah. evening. Tracy, thank you so much. And it's time to stop and smell the flowers on Michigan Avenue. The annual Fleur de Vie display features more than a dozen mannequins covered in thousands of fresh flowers. You can see it for yourself, 900 North Michigan shops, and that exhibit runs through Sunday. Although you may raise eyebrows if you stop to smell the roses. <laughs> 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 Maybe. To be on somebody's corset. Yeah, exactly. Uh, hey, we'll see you tomorrow.